Hello everyone. In this video, I am going to tell you how to georeference a topo sheet. As you all know, topo sheet is also known as topographical sheets, and in India, you will you can buy all the topo sheets from Survey of India. They are also known as Survey of India topo sheets. So first of all you have to buy a topo sheet from survey of india then after buying a topo sheet you have to scan a topo sheet so that you can add the jpg of that topo sheet to the arc map let's see how we can do it this is the add button as you all know from here we can add the vector and raster data so here i am going to add a topo sheet which is already being purchased and scanned by me so here you can see unknown spatial reference means the topo sheet is not referenced means it is not having a location you cannot locate any object or feature on this topo sheet according to the earth location so first of all we are going to add this we will click the okay and here as you can see the topo sheet which is being scanned scan topo sheet is opened in this vid window so first of all uh, i want to tell you some features of this this is the open series map this is also known as osm series means in this series you will not find osm means in this series you will not find the heights and contours here it is written heights and contours are not being shown so this is our open series map and now we are going to georeference it so while uh, you are referencing a topo sheet we are going to use this tool this is known as zoom in zoom out pan and full extent when we will click the full extent the whole topo sheet will be shown in this video window so in this section effect layer if you have more than two or three layers then you have to click the layer which you want to georeference here also you have to select the image which you want to georeference this is the control at control point from here we can just click it and take it to the left corner of this topo sheet the more you zoom in the topo sheet the more precisely you can fill the values just click it left click and then right click and here you can input dms means degree minute second 
of longitude and land latitude so here first of all we have to put the value of longitude as 81 degree 30 minutes and we will put 0 so this is in the east so east is here then latitude is 27 degree 30 minutes and 0 seconds north as india is in the northern hemisphere and in the eastern hemisphere so we have selected east and north and we will click ok now as you see the topo sheet is disappeared from your window so again click on the topo sheet and zoom to layer button now again it is visible to you just click the zoom button zoom the next corner Take your add control point, click over here. First of all, your left click of your mouse, then the right click of your mouse. Now input the DMS. Here you can see it's 81 degree, 45 minutes and 0 seconds. The latitude is 27 degree, 30 minutes, 0 seconds and OK. Now your topo sheet doesn't disappear as we have given the second point also. Likewise, we will give the third point also just take your add control point from your left click just left click right click input dms and here we will put the values are 81 45 and 0 then here 27 15, again 0, ok. So now we have to give the fourth point. Again, your left click, then right click, input DMS. Here we will put 81, 30 minutes, 00. zero. Again, latitude is 27, 15 and 0 seconds. We will do click OK. Now as we have added all the four points of this topo sheets then we will click here georeferencing we will click update georeferencing and then zoom to layer.
now one thing i want to tell you tell you all like if you have put some where a wrong add control point then here is a window window to view the link like all four are the correct one but this fifth one is the wrong one so from here we can delete this link now our topo sheet is being geo reference so from here you can export your topo sheet we will add a folder over here in the location from here we can select the img format we can give the name bahraich as it is a bahraich topo sheet and we can save it here the geo reference file is being exported to a new location see the special reference over here we have given it a wgs 1984 datum and universal transverse marketer projection and it for as it falls in 44 zone so we have given it a 44 zone once the file is exported you can add the topo sheet and now you can work on this topo sheet once the process is completed you can add the topo sheet as a map layer here the topo sheet is added to your window so you can remove the jpg format and now you can work on this img format which is geo reference and now all the work which you will done is will be geo reference so the display units i am converting the displaying units to degree minute seconds i'll do okay now you can see if i want to know the location or the latitude or longitude of this khale purwa i can know it is longitude is 81 degree 34 minute 20 here you can see all the information as you drag your mouse around the topo sheet you can see the latitude and longitude information all over the topo sheet so now your topo sheet is ready to work in the next video we will learn how to create shape files so that we can work on this topo sheet
Have a nice day.